So I want to switch gears a bit. Okay. You also deactivated your OnlyFans account. Mm -hmm. And I hear that was the source of a lot of your money. And I want to just clear this up right now. Because there is a two hundred and thirty-nine million dollar discrepancy right now going on. I've seen it. You have. So, April twenty twenty-two, you said you made one million dollars from it in twenty twenty-one, but now I'm seeing reports that are saying two hundred and forty million. What's what's the actual number? The actual number it was close to two million within a two wait within a two year span. So I opened it in 2020. So right when the pandemic had hit, I had opened it because I was like, oh, my gosh, like what's about to happen? And I had just recently did a TV show called Only Cams where I produced it and um, filmed on it just a little bit. So it kind of like gave me the leeway to kind of doing it because it was something that I didn't want to do at first. But at the time, I had so many lawsuits and so many things that I was dealing with. Aside from that, I'm like, I got to figure out how can I like continue to have like my house, take care of my kids, do everything I need to do. So that's why I started the OnlyFans. But I definitely, let's clear this up, I definitely did not make 240 million. Okay. I definitely did it. She did not make 240 not. million, you guys. I, I did oh. not. So it, I know a major part of that, as you said, was mm -hmm. to provide for your kids and kind of keep up that standard of living that they're accustomed to. Yes. How do you plan on doing that going forward? I'm letting faith lead me, honestly, and it's been it's been it's been really good. Yeah. Like I'm not even worrying about like where is like my next deal or where is this coming from? Where is this coming from? I'm just gonna put my right foot in front of my left and my left foot in front of my right and keep it pushing. I totally understand. Yeah, that. I do. 